sites are in, and you do have very strong social learning abilities. Now, okay, I have known some cardboard complete morons. You don't seem that way at all. So why don't you ever worry about life outside the tank? Well, I have everything I need right here. I have fresh water, and I have a filter, and I have a fabulous area to swim in, and I have food fed to me three times a day. Tussie, remember not to overeat. Okay. Okay. And I have a good friend who I may one day ask to fertilize my eggs and have some fry if the water's fresh enough. Oh, although right now we're taking it slow, trying not to rush things or define the relationship. So why should I worry about anything else? Don't you ever think about the afterlife? About the next plane of existence? Never question where you came from or where you're going? No, I don't. And neither should you. A militant agnostic, huh? I don't know, and you don't either. Look, I'm not some stupid fish just swimming around in circles, not ever considering that there's something beyond what we know. But if we knew for certain that there is an afterlife, we would not fear death as we do, and we would not mourn quite so agonizingly the death of loved ones, and there would be no need to engage in debate on the subject. Ah, so you have thought this through. Well, so, since we can't know for certain, I'd rather not think about it at all. Otherwise, we'd end up spending all of our time thinking about it. And we'd have to invent religion and literature, poetry, science, and even humor. And why? We're goldfish. You more? I intend to live forever. So far? So good. I'm impressed, Carrie. Just don't assume we're just a bunch of stupid fish because we don't share your views. Even Tessie here has his moments, right, Tessie? Oh, wow! That one was chocolate flavored! 